Ever pictured the streets of Mumbai jam-packed? But not with humans behind the wheel. Imagine a world where your next ride is a driverless car, gliding quietly past chai stores and rickshaws. Sounds wild, right? Well, hold on to your seat, because India might be about to leapfrog into a new era of mobility. From the buzzing markets of Delhi to the high-speed expressways crisscrossing Bengaluru, India's self-driving revolution is picking up serious speed. Tata is engineering homegrown tech that's turning heads worldwide. Tesla's plotting its grand entrance, promising to electrify India's roads, literally. And don't count out the homegrown startups and tech visionaries throwing their hats into the ring. But why this sudden shift? For starters, India's cities are swelling at a rapid pace and the nation's infamous traffic jams aren't getting any shorter. Air pollution? Off the charts. Road safety? Still a work in progress. Enter autonomous vehicles, loaded with smart sensors, AI brains and super precise maps that can spot a cow in the road before you even see it. Big names like Google, Tesla and Ola are each betting big on this tech. And Indian startups are right there in the mix, building AI algorithms tailor-made for the country's unique challenges. We're talking next-level sensors that can handle monsoon floods, potholes and yes, the odd herd of goats. But it's not all smooth sailing. India's legal system is still playing catch-up, trying to untangle questions like who's to blame if a robot car crashes? How do we keep all that driver data safe? And what rules should we set for an industry that's moving faster than the traffic on the Mumbai-Pune Expressway? Get this right though, and the rewards are huge. Imagine less gridlock, fewer accidents, and way more freedom for people who can't drive, especially the elderly or differently abled. Picture an India where you can summon a self-driving taxi at the tap of a button, or where entire bus fleets run themselves, slashing costs and cutting carbon footprints. Tesla's plans for India. They want to bring their cutting-edge EVs and autonomous know-how to the subcontinent, while homegrown giants like Tata are already field-testing some seriously smart vehicles. It's a tech race, and everyone's gunning for pole position. Here's the bottom line. India stands at the crossroads of a mobility revolution. But to really make it work, we need government, industry and researchers working together. Setting ground rules, solving ethical puzzles, and making sure nobody's left behind. So, next time you're stuck in traffic, just picture this. A future where the cars drive themselves and you're free to just enjoy the ride. The question isn't if, but when. Are you ready for India's self-driving future?